up guys we're back and this is gonna be part one of the five speed swap this is pretty much an informative video and we're not really gonna be wrenching today I'm just gonna be showing you guys what you guys would need if you guys were interested in doing this swap so the main piece that you guys are gonna need is a transmission Millie what are you doing? Come inside! Oh my god, transmission. But not just any transmission, the 5 speed transmission. Specifically, if you have a fresh gen Tacoma like me with a 3.4 motor, the 5 BZs, you guys are gonna need a R150F driver side drop transfer keys if you guys are for wheel drive. And the next part you need is a flywheel. And the flywheel bolts up to the crank on the motor and also some flywheel bolts because your automatic transmission uses a flex plate and the bolts are kind of different. So I got this flywheel off of eBay along with the clutch but it's an Isin brand. So Isin is like they make OEM Toyota parts and I tried my best to stay OEM with this swap, so that's why I chose Icing. As for the flywheel bolts, I got them off of LCE Engineering, LCE Performance, which is also OEM quality, or well, as they stated. Uh, I'm gonna go over here, and here's the clutch. So this whole kit came with the flywheel, the clutch, this, the pressure plate, alignment tool, clutch alignment tool, we got pilot bearing, which goes onto there, well not here, but when we bolt it up to the crank, and also a throw up bearing. And the bearings are, what is it, Nachi? I'm not too sure if I'm pronouncing it correctly, but it says Nachi inside there. Focus, man. Yeah, I'm having a hard time focusing on it. But Nachi is another good um, quality brand that Toyota uses sometimes, I believe. I don't know, I read it on a forum, but it also is made in Japan you guys cannot see that but it says Japan too uh, this is pretty much the pressure plate but it says icing as well as the clutch same thing icing stuff and moving on this way you will need a clutch pedal and this is optional but a uh, five-speed brake pedal so the brake pedal in your automatic cars or trucks the pedal itself is actually thicker so when you put the clutch pedal next to it it's kind of close so I ordered a five-speed brake pedal because I didn't want it to be close or like didn't want to I know some people they, they chop it or with, with a grinder and stuff but I'm trying to keep it all original as possible I also ordered these clutch pads or brake pads and again that's optional if your zone doesn't have it or if your zone is bust up like this and in my case bolt <laughs> because this one is bust up and this one didn't have so yeah this is optional though up to you and here is the 
clutch master cylinder so this one goes inside your engine bay and we gotta poke a hole in the fire the firewall for the rod so it pretty much bolts up to this right here oh no that's a break oh no that's yeah so it pretty much bolts up to this like you see the two bolts right there there's the two bolts over here right there and I'll be showing you how to drill a hole in your firewall for the clutch master in probably next episode clutch master is also icing OEM and uh, here's a cut sleeve. I'm uh, not too sure if this is the icing. I tried to find one, but I couldn't. Also, transmission mount, eBay, which was like 30 bucks. But the transmission that I have already has a, trans a five speed transmission mount connected to it. But I just wanted to change it anyways since I'm gonna be dealing with the transmission so might as well, brand new. And the two parts that I'm missing that you also need to do the swap, which I don't have yet, are the pressure plate bolts and also the clutch line. I ordered the pressure plate bolts off of LC Performance as well, but it didn't come in yet. And I ordered the clutch line off of make George Toyota but same thing never came in yet and I'm planning to do the swap or start on the swap at least tomorrow already because my truck has been sitting and I've been using my dad's car for the past few days for work and stuff but yeah I really gotta get my truck back on the road so gotta get it done but the pressure plate bolts that I was talking about that I don't have they're pretty much to bolt up the pressure plate to the flywheel. So it's just bolts to put over here. And the clutch line that I also mentioned about that I don't have is for connecting the master to the slave. So the slave goes, it bolts onto the trans. So pretty much connect the rod to this and then when you press the pedal it pumps fluid to the slave which pushes out a rod right here to I guess disengage the clutch on the transmission but even though I don't have the parts yet I wanted to do the I wanted to do this parts video to show you guys what mainly what you need because I'm planning to start throwing parts on the truck already like uh, putting this Drilling my firewall and installing the clutch pedal is the first thing I think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna start off with just so when help is here, Jason, some of my other boys, then I can go ahead and drop the trans. Pretty much switch out the trans, put the clutch up, and there's also some cutting involved in cutting the cap out for the shifter. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna try and do what I can. Like stuff that I can do by myself, I'm gonna do it. You can swap the trans by yourself. But I don't have a transmission jack. When I converted the truck, I kinda did it by myself. But I had a transmission jack. I borrowed one. There's like other small stuff that you gotta make sure you have or make sure to get before you actually take on the swap because when I ordered the clutch pedal, um, you also need like a dowel pin or not double pin, like a clevis pin. Like you know the a pin that has like a hole and you put the clip on it. So you're gonna you're gonna need that to hold this together. But I'm pretty sure you could use like a I'm not in bolt though. But a clevis pin with the clip is the proper way to do it. Also for the slave going to your transmission where it bolts to your transmission um, my transmission it 
it's missing those bolts as well so I gotta get that too because I just don't want to take on the swap and come to find like there's stuff that I'm actually missing and I gotta go run to the parts store or any store hardware store whatever to go grab it so I'm hoping I have everything oh yeah and <laughs> the nuts for this too to hold this but other than that I think I do have everything so I'm hoping that the swap goes smoothly and if it doesn't you guys will probably see everything you're also gonna need a shifter trim for like the shift boot and stuff which I ordered off of eBay it's for the interior and that's another part I also don't have yet I have one but I ordered that one because you know why this one has a cup holder on it <laughs> and the trans that I bought it came with a shifter trim but it doesn't have the cup holder and it's kind of in a beat up condition so I just ordered one so if I don't get that in by the time I'm done with the swap then I'm probably just gonna throw that the beat up one for now and then swap it out later on I'll post up all the links in the description down below of all the parts that you need and the parts that I bought and where I bought it from but for example like stuff from eBay I bought it like used from certain people and the link of the original listing probably wouldn't work anymore because I bought it and they don't have like multiple for sale but I can put what you can search up on eBay to find those parts and everything else but yeah guys if you guys are planning to do a 5 speed swap on your Tacoma or if you're curious how to do it or if you're just watching this video for entertainment and following up with my life my luck with cars this truck I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful and please subscribe stay tuned for the upcoming videos and the next part to swapping my truck to manual again this was just an informative video there's no really action going on in this video but stay tuned for all the action so be sure to subscribe catch you guys on the next one shoots